and we got busy and then uh, uh, after it got busy you know we started cleaning up and, and then you know we opened the door to, and she's not here. New tonight, a long sentence for a North Canton mom who admits to murder in that call you just heard. Five-year-old Ashley Zhao was reported missing last January by her parents. Then, days later, police found the little girl's body hidden inside her parents' Chinese restaurant. Their faces made headlines nationally as investigators learned that Ming Ming Chen killed Ashley with blows to her head and convinced her husband to hide the body. Liang Zhao testified against his wife in agreement or exchange for a 12-year sentence. Chen is not a U.S. citizen, and Don Kendrick, you're telling us that played a factor in today's sentencing of Ming Ming Chen. It did, absolutely. The, the judge decided 22 years behind bars, but then said she will, after she serves that, be uh, sent back to China to answer your question. But she is getting 22 years. She's 29 year old. Ming Ming Chen doesn't bring her daughter back though that sentence. The five year old who complete strangers moored for after police found her body concealed inside her parents restaurant. It was the victim, five-year-old Ashley Zhao, who was weighing heavily on the heart of Judge Chris Hartnett. Almost a year ago, police found her little body at Ang's Asian Cuisine, her parents' restaurant in North Canton. Her mother, Ming Ming Chen, who originally reported Ashley as missing, heading to prison today for her death. That I would sentence you to a total period of 22 years. 22 years under a negotiated guilty plea agreement. The sentence could have been 30 years. Chen's attorney said today that his client, quote, doesn't make any excuses. I do believe that my client wanted to be a loving mother to her two children. There's a tremendous amount of pressure that was put upon this couple and led to violence in the home. Stark County Judge Chris Hartnett told Chen, quote, 100 years is not enough. A child should be, should be able to rely upon a parent for their protection, for their safety, for their love. And in this case, I find it difficult to imagine the horror for your child, Ashley. The horror of being beaten by her own mother, and I use the word mother with great pain, I find, when talking to you. It's insulting to mothers who do what they are supposed to do for their children. Through a translator, Chen told the judge she is, quote, apologetic for what happened, especially to my daughter. I will perform very well. John Ferrero, Stark County prosecuting attorney, today said, quote, this was not an act of premeditated murder, nor was it an act in which Ming Ming Chen purposely caused the death of young Ashley Zhao. Therefore, this case never qualified, he says, for the death penalty under the laws of the state of Ohio. Judge Hartnett not mincing words today, though, when she told Chen, and this is a quote, the only consolation I have is that she is far better off without you as a parent. Chen, by the way, as we mentioned, is also in this country illegally and was in the process of being deported before all of this even happened. Ferrero says he expects her to be deported to China after she serves her 22 years. The more details we learn about this, the more devastating even it becomes. Right, and I, I was really struck by the judge. You could tell that little girl was so on her heart. And, and um, you know, we talk about the sentence and we talk about all the details. The fact is it doesn't bring her back. It's just tragic. All right. Thank you very much, Don. Mm -hmm.